A Maryland woman is keeping her family legacy alive with coffee beans. Keisha Butts has the details about a new online shop. I like that it reminds me of my family, first and foremost. Um, I like that it gives you an extra, you know, jolt of energy in the morning before you go to work or on the weekends before you go to run your errands. I just love coffee. Meet Teresa Mead. This job enthusiast created Jack and Joe's Coffee during the pandemic to honor her late mother and grandfather. She says her mother would always order a white chocolate mocha with oat milk. She loved coffee when I went to my grandfather's house. Um, he was a chef, an entrepreneur as well. He would always have a fresh pot of coffee brewing. Everything he did, watching wrestling, watching the news, you know, he had a cup of coffee. And at a young age, I just was like, I have to have coffee. Coffee was like something we did as a family. Right now, you can only order Jack and Joe's coffee online or at different pop-ups she hosts in Maryland. Mead has about 20 to 30 flavors with Cinnabon as the most popular. And her customers come from all over, including New York. It feels great. Growing up in the family of entrepreneurs, I already felt like there was nothing that I couldn't do. So that kind of helped me at a young age. And like I said before, to have a brand that represents and leaves a legacy for my family, it means everything. While Jack and Joe's Coffee is an online business now, Mead plans to open a shop in the future. For CTV News, Keisha Butts. Jack and Joe's Coffee Beans come from Ethiopia, Kenya, and Tanzania. For more information, you can go to jackandjoescoffee.com.